I've never really been interested in money uh, and the mechanics of it. So it took me quite a while to sort of get it. I always thought economics was really complicated and boring. Um, I always cared about nature and uh, environmental issues and I couldn't really understand why we treated you know, the plants and animals and nature this way because it's very obvious that we need the environment um, and I thought we should really care more about taking care of it and um, keeping it clean. Um, I, I understood that we wanted some progress and, but I couldn't understand why this clash is uh, happening and I, I saw that there are certain forces sort of working behind the scenes but I couldn't wrap my brain around it. Um, and a couple of years ago, a friend of mine mentioned positive money to me. So then I started watching um, videos online and sort of slowly connecting the dots. Um, the crucial moment for me was seeing the talk that Michael Robotham um, gave in Canada to Coma in 1999. And it just everything sort of fell into place. Um, he connected everything I cared about to the way that we create money. And it was just so clear. And from then on, for me, it just became the most important thing. I could trace so many different issues that I came in contact with in my everyday life, sort of trace it back to money. So then I decided I had to do something about it. Um, so I started this movement in Croatia, um, and it's very, very slowly growing. Um, I saw, the, I see this whole situation as if the world was this big Tupperware box, and someone sort of placed a stone underneath it on one side, and it sort of tipped the balance a little bit, and everything that we have sort of trickles down to one side and creates this inequality. <coughs> And we're being very clever about it and creative and we're investing a lot of energy into fixing single issues um, and fighting for this or that and trying to make things more equal, try, trying to redistribute. Uh, but I feel that there's this one thing that we could do that would very simply put things back. If we could remove that little rock and create a flat surface again, then I feel that so many different things would just passively resolve themselves. And I think that little stone is the money system today. And I think that together we can change it.